This video is for the higher level IB Biology Theme D, Continuity and Change. In this video, we will look at how monoclonal antibodies are used in pregnancy tests. HCG is human chorionic gonadotrophin and it's the pregnancy hormone. In a pregnancy test, monoclonal antibodies that have been specifically designed to recognise and bind to HCG are used. These antibodies are produced in the laboratory from mice plasma B cells, which are fused with tumour cells to make hybridoma cells, and it is these hybridoma cells that produce the monoclonal antibodies. These monoclonal antibodies are often labelled with a dye, allowing them to produce a visible signal when they bind to HCG. This is essential for creating the positive test result line on the test strip. When a woman is pregnant, HCG is present in her urine. When the test stick is dipped into the urine, the labelled monoclonal antibodies in the mobile antibody area here will bind to any HCG present, forming an HCG antibody complex. As the urine continues to move along the test strip, the HCG antibody complexes reach the test area here, where there are more immobilised antibodies specific to HCG. The HCG antibody complexes bind to these immobilised antibodies, resulting in the formation of a coloured line that indicates a positive pregnancy test. Additional immobilised antibodies further along the strip are specific to the labelled antibodies serving as a control line. This check line ensures that the test is functioning properly confirming that the test stick has been used correctly. And that's the end of this short video on pregnancy tests. I'll leave you with a summary of the key terms that you should try to use when answering a question on this topic.